Hi, I'm Shonkar with you. Uh, in this video, I'll show you how you can solve your um, bootloader burning problem in your custom Arduino board. So think about my situation. This is one of my custom Arduino board, right? You see that? And, and the microcontroller is 18 mega 328 microcontroller. So I need to upload a um, bootloader into this microcontroller so that I can upload um, the sketch from Arduino ID easily. So in that case, uh, let me let me first connect with this board. And this is just a uh, adapter so that I can connect my USB SD programmer uh, with my custom board, right? Okay, let me connect with this one just for wait for a minute. This one, and after that, just plugging the USB SD with my computer. Okay. Just try. Okay, now I need to upload the um, bootloader from the Arduino ID. For, the, uh, for this reason, I have to select the programmer as USB ASP that is already selected, and then I have to select the board type that is Arduino Uno that is already selected. So, just now, I, what I have to do, I just have to do uh, the burn bootloader from the tools option. Okay, so I hope, okay, uh, there is a problem with the burning bootloader that is the known as the and driver problem so sometimes you will get such type of problem and sometimes you will get this type of problem this is the error i got for the end the situation so this is the situation mainly you will face problem while uploading your bootloader right so in such cases uh, what you can do you can solve this problem easily just uh, updating your um, usb asp driver so for doing this you have to download the software that is um, the zedic dot ake o.ie so you have to download the software and after that you can upload your driver easily right let me show you first okay just open the software after opening the software uh, you will see that um, there are a few options but you have to load the driver or all the driver options so that you have to list all the devices now you will see there are many devices options so you have to select the usb sp from the device option after that you see my current driver is leave usb 0 i hope to, i have to update this driver so i will select the driver from this drop down menu right so let's uh, update this driver with uh, leave usb k I hope this will solve my problem. Leave USB key and um, sometimes I also try to it uh, win USB and uh, that's also works for me but uh, I will choose leave USB key for this situation. So leave USB key and I will replace my driver. Uh, leave USB key. Okay. So just replace the previous driver with this one. And after that you have to wait for a few minutes so that the driver installation process is completed. Just wait for a minute. And this is one of the problem I face uh, most of the times while I'm just uh, burning bootloader into a new um, 80 mega 3 unit microcontroller. I will show you another problem that might uh, that might cause um, uploading your uh, bootloader into the uh, 80 mega 3 unit microcontroller. Okay. By this time, let me show you um, the another problem. You can see that um, there is a um, there is a two pin connection this one and the traditional usb asp this is known as slow sck slow sck, slow SCK is when you are uh, just uploading a new 80 mega 328 microcontroller in that case the microcontroller might be just running on one megahertz so while, while your microcontroller is running on one megahertz in in, in, in such situation you have to um, slow down your uh, sbi communication that's why this uh, you have to connect or uh, you have to shorten these two pins so that the SPA communication can communicate slower speed uh, for the one megahertz microcontroller so that you can upload your bootloader easily. So, so just remember this one as well because you might face problem for this one as well. So this are the these are all the problems you might face uh, because of hardware related or driver related problem. So I hope now my problem is solved. Let me just upload my uh, bootloader again. Just right. See. A burning bootloader IO boards, this may take a minute. Okay, just try for a minute, it's not a big deal. Oh, now I'm done burning bootloader. See, and so that's all about the uh, Arduino bootloader burning problem using USB ASP. Okay, 
thank you very much uh, so if you like this um, video please uh, try to um, subscribe my channel also share your video with your friends so that they can solve the problem easily okay thank you very much